The Real to Real program developed by Gentleman Jack is an incredible opportunity for young African-American storytellers to tell their story and to win $10,000 at doing so. Winning the Gentleman Jack Real to Real contest has completely changed my life in, in very good ways. Um, I always believed in myself as a filmmaker, uh, as a writer and a director, and I wrote and direct the, directed the story um, for the competition. Um, but to be able to partner with other people in Atlanta, namely the um, executive producer, Max McClintock, who also stars in the film, and Dom Cole, who stars with her, that was incredible to be able to go along with my counterparts in Atlanta and make films that matter and then to be able to submit it and then win and for people to recognize that art and that passion is incredible so to continue to kind of spread that message and be here with Amari and talk about that and continue to put good art into the world that is uh, a part of all the good stuff that comes with it and then of course the ten thousand dollars we're at a place where we can help other people of all races that's right. and all um, genders be a part of the story. Yep, and I think that's, right. that's the exciting part. It's not just I'm Relegated black. Relegated to black Hollywood. Right. Yeah. I'm yeah. black and I'm making films, but yeah. I'm creating stories for everyone. And then everyone else comes sit at the table with us and create. We now are at the precipice of movies and storytelling going to another place, another graduated level because of the success of a one Ryan Coogler. And Ryan Coogler is, you know, paramount in terms of me listing a litany of people that have benefited from programs like Real to Real or ABFF, uh, which it conjoins itself with at times. In reality, um, the billion dollars that the movie Black Panther um, has made is very much in direct correlation with the filmmaker who's from Oakland, who was but a dreamer, who was but a brown American and that being Ryan Coogler, so. And also Ava DuVernay. And Ava DuVernay, of yeah, course, and the success that she found, mm -hmm. uh, not only a month ago as well. Right. Um, working alongside Oprah Winfrey, again. But in reality, it's, it's, an interesting, um, it's an interesting question that you ask because this program, you know, a lot of times you don't get the proof is in the pudding. But this actual actualization of somebody having a dream, putting it in a 10 minute short, winning $10,000 of, of, of money for that uh, ability or that craft that they've honed and continue to hone can one day turn $10,000 into a billion dollars mm -hmm. for an industry now. The 10000 that John Latte won was for her and her crew and her team and her dream. It was a prize of sorts of what she could smartly allocate where it need be. But he's made a billion dollars, which actually moves the industry forward. And Ryan Coogler was very much a part of programs like Real to real, and so um, that's, that's pretty amazing when you think about it. That's proof in the pudding that these programs work and are very needed and have been needed prior to this. So hats off again to Gentleman Jack for being a pioneer, for, for going, we believe in these voices and these storytellers. So you should go to GentlemanJackFilm.com. Again, that is GentlemanJackFilm.com. And the submission's what, May 8th? Is that what Yeah, it ends May 8th. And then after that, people have a chance to vote online um, by watching people's trailers and getting to know more about the filmmaker. So the public can be involved in picking the next Which great filmmaker cool. as well. Yeah. The people great. have a voice. That's always a good yeah. thing. Yeah.